Hi guys, got another unboxing video here. This is of the Latrex 118 scale four wheel drive rally car. Stock radio. I'm not gonna really get into that because I will be using my own radio gear. For people that are familiar with me, you pretty much know the gear that I use. Manual. And the most important part for me car but before I get to that yeah. okay batteries for the radio which I probably won't use because I have rechargeable batteries in my radio you have the this is a car charger actually um, in my case probably won't do me any good I guess if for people that's out and about I guess it's good for them you know but for me it's not gonna do me any, any justice in what I'm gonna be using this for which you guys will see later what exactly I will be using this for not later today but there's some videos to come It's kind of dull. <laughs> I'll be back. All right, got the car unboxed. Body pins off. It's just a stock car. It's only a hundred nine dollar car, so you can't really have really high expectations. But this is going to be for something that we're doing here locally. We're going to be racing these on an the indoor carpet track. Um, can't wait to get back into it. It's something that we used to do all the time, but they kind of kind of fell off around here. And we got a few upgrades, which I'll show you in just a moment, that you can do to this car in the box stock class. It's not much, but it's a few things that you can do to kind of make the car a little bit more competitive. Okay, so these are the upgrades that you can actually run this class and this is more for appearance because from what I understand it's over 40 people that have bought this car so it's going to be a bunch of people racing it on an indoor track um, and really don't need to paint a body to kind of stand out because a lot of people I mean there's only so many color options with this car so a lot of people are going to pretty much have the same color bodies I'm going to practice with this body and I'll probably end up racing with this body just depending on um, who's going to be in that class that we're racing with. More experienced racers, I'll race with the body that I'm going to paint up. If not, we're just going to race with the stock body. So the next thing we can upgrade, well not necessarily upgrade, we can change. It's still going to be a... Uh, an option it's just appearance these are black chrome wheels which I really like uh, I always have like the black wheels I actually got black wheels on my real car so this is another thing that I got for this car for this box stock class next thing which is gonna be a must because this car comes with um, bushings so bearings we can upgrade the bearings and the next thing are gonna be the diffs which are plastic diffs so I mean, at 109, you really can't expect too much out of this car. So I'm going to upgrade the diffs also. So I've heard they had a whole bunch of issues with those. And the servo. Only thing that we can't upgrade in the box stock class that I really wish we could are these friction shocks. Which I think going to suck. But 
we won't know until we get them out on the track. Hopefully, I'll get some footage tomorrow. I'm not really sure uh, if I will or not, but it's just a matter of if I have time to get there and do what I'm going to do. But they are going to have another class, which is going to be your modified class, which is, we don't know the rules yet, but uh, from what I understand, we can do the light pole, motor changes. Um, so I got something in mind, which I have a video up pretty soon with that. I got something that's going to be pretty sweet. I think it's going to be a very competitive competitive platform once I get done with it. Alright guys, thanks for watching.